Working across cultures, long-term versus short-term orientation. Hello, English learners and global professionals. In today's video, we will be diving deep into an essential aspect of global business culture, understanding cultural differences. One of the critical cultural dimensions we need to consider is long-term versus short-term orientation. Let's embark on this enlightening journey to understand how different cultures view time, planning, and business relations. Long-term and short-term orientation refers to the extent to which a culture values long-standing traditions, connections, and future rewards versus immediate benefits and present realities. Long-term orientation cultures emphasize perseverance, thriftiness, and adapting to circumstances. They focus on the future and are more willing to delay immediate rewards for future benefits. An example can be the emphasis on saving for future generations in many Asian cultures. Short-term orientation cultures, on the other hand, value tradition and the present. They prioritize current benefits, immediate results, and quick feedback. For instance, you might observe a more significant focus on quarterly results in Western businesses. Understanding these orientations is crucial for international business because it affects decision-making. Cultures with a long-term orientation may take longer to make decisions, as they consider the implications on future generations or long-term goals. Negotiations. In a short-term oriented culture, businesses might want to see immediate profits, while those from a long-term oriented culture might be willing to invest time and resources for future gains. Conflict resolution. Understanding these differences can help navigate conflicts in international teams, as you'd know if the other party is looking at immediate solutions or a long-term perspective. 1. Educate yourself. Before entering a new market or collaborating with international teams, research their cultural orientation. Knowledge is power. 2. Be patient and flexible. Recognize that your way of thinking might be different. Be open to understanding and adapting. 3. Ask questions. If unsure, ask your international colleagues about their perspective. It helps bridge the gap and fosters understanding. 4. Balance both perspectives. Sometimes, it's beneficial to combine both orientations. Look for immediate wins while also planning for the long term. In our ever-globalizing world, understanding cultural dimensions like the long-term versus short-term orientation can significantly influence your success in international business. Always remember, it's not about which perspective is better, but understanding and respecting differences. We hope this video enlightens and aids you in your global ventures. Keep learning, and see you in the next video.